welcome back to my channel friends and thank you all so much for being here i'm very excited for today's video because i'm going to bring you along as we transform our living room into a cozy fall space i'm going to start out over on my bookshelf and take everything down that i have on it all of my spring and summer books and candlesticks that way we can start with a clean blank canvas here is a before look at the living room. I'm really excited to get it all warmed up for fall with all of those warm colors. And I'm also gonna be removing the console from our sofa. I'm just really ready to enjoy the sofa without it for a while to switch it up and to also give us a little bit more room in here. Um, with the holidays coming up and everything and all of the decorations, I just think it'll feel more open and it also just looks a little bit more aesthetically pleasing without it, even though we have loved having it in for the past few months that we've had the sofa, but it'll just make it easier to switch it into a bed for fun, cozy fall and winter movie nights and we've already been loving it for a nice little change so now we're going to add lots of dried hydrangeas and pumpkins over into our bookshelf we have harvested several more pumpkins since my last video we recently picked this light orange one and it is one of my favorites it's so so pretty and also several more green ones so i added some of those once i got them washed over to our bookcase out several different pillow arrangements it took me so long to figure out which pillows I wanted on the couch for fall but I ended up going with my sweater pillow covers that I got from Hobby Lobby several years ago they just look so nice for fall and winter so I brought those back out and I'm gonna use those in here with my wall pillow covers that I made in one of my recent videos and then also this little neutral pumpkin pillow from Kirkland's over to decorate our little ottoman i recently found this piece at a thrift store i don't believe i've shared it in a video yet but i've had it for over a month now i could not believe when i spotted it at the thrift store and it's the perfect little size to go here in the middle of the living room whether we have the console in or out of the sofa not only does it warm up the center of the room but it's also the perfect spot to put drinks on or anything else that we need to set on it we have used it every single day so it's been such a good purchase and i also love that it has storage inside of it i also recently thrifted these beautiful fall magazines that have so much fall inspiration in them and i love to have them out so i put them underneath this ironstone pitcher full of more dried hydrangeas It took me so long to figure out what I wanted to go over here on our side table, but I ended up going with a pitcher of dried wheat and grass. I love the natural feel that it adds over here. And then also one of our homegrown pumpkins. I love this little green one. I just think it is precious. So I wanted to put it on display over here on our side table. I always make sure to also put a saucer or something like that underneath our homegrown pumpkins just in case they were to go bad it won't ruin like the furniture so I always place a little saucer underneath and that is what our little side table looks like now 
moving on to my favorite area of the living room. It looks almost exactly the same as last year, but I loved it so much last year that I wanted to recreate the same look. Several years ago, a subscriber and friend who I met here through YouTube made me this banner that says Gobble. It is just the cutest Thanksgiving banner ever and it fits my style so well. So I love to add it to our TV stand each year. This fireplace has been one of the best purchases. We got this from Lowe's in 2022. And again, just one of the best purchases. It really makes our living room feel so much more cozy. Now to the top of the fireplace, I'm going to layer together these brown leaves and this leaf garland that I got from Hobby Lobby last year. I'm not going to add the dried florals to it this year just to keep it a little bit more clean and simple, but I just love how the leaves look on this fireplace. It brings in so much warm fall color. It's been a year since I thrifted this brass quilt rack. I was so excited when I found this and it's still one of my top favorite thrift finds of all time. I love to layer all the cozy blankets over here on it. So I grabbed my favorite fall throws and I love the color that it adds over here. Last year I layered my pumpkins like this over here in front of the fireplace so I was playing around with the placement of these this year and trying to decide if this is where I wanted them to go again but I ended up liking them more on the other side of the fireplace it balanced out the wall better so I'll share that later in the video but that is where they ended up and I just love our little fireplace area As you saw, I also switched out the artwork above our TV for a fall painting that I thrifted. It's this gorgeous cabin scene. And then I also switched out the blue taper candles for orange ones with little leaves on them. I found those at Hobby Lobby last year and they're just precious. to 
our large hutch. I'm going to take everything out of it and it took me several days of working on this to figure out how I wanted it. It was just a long process of figuring out like the perfect placement and seeing what I liked, trial and error, but we finally got it and I'm really happy with how it turned out. If you have been watching for a couple years, um, we got this hutch from a family member who was giving it away and my husband redid it and it's just such a beautiful addition to our home. I'm so thankful for it and it's always very fun to decorate for the seasons. So I'm going to layer in my friendly village dishes along with leaves and baskets and pumpkins and my pumpkin pie plate and just make it all cozy in here for fall. on this shelf in our living room my husband had the idea to put three of our orange pie pumpkins up here and I think it turned out so sweet they're just so cute up there and it was such a good idea so I love how that little shelf turned out and that is how our living room looks this year for fall enjoyed watching this and that it gave you some inspiration that you can use in your own homes or that you just enjoyed watching me decorate and transform our living room into a cozy fall space. Next we're going to be decorating our kitchen and I'm going to bring you along for that. I didn't do very much in there this year but I'm still excited to 
cozy it up for fall and do some fall baking along with you in an upcoming video so stay tuned for that we're also going to be doing more thrifting soon that i'm going to bring you along for and i just can't wait so i hope that you all have a wonderful rest of your day and your week and i will see you next time Thank you.